Yes. Uh, hello, welcome to Always Be Comedy. Yay. Yay. Uh, bless you all, lovely to see you, Timo, my love. I reckon we can. Uh, I reckon we can get a couple more on the front row. If any, anyone at home fancies joining the front row, my mum is watching tonight from Leeds. I can hear uh -oh. her saying out loud that she would rather shoot herself than go on the front row. <laughs> <laughs> anyone else fancies it? You all look great. Carol and Dave, give us a wave. <laughs> Fucking hell, Tim, th wow. their sign is more high tech than anything we've done in a year. <laughs> uh, bless you, thank you for joining us. Dave, what does your t-shirt say? It's a, it's the Cagouls. You know, yeah. Nicky Wilkinson and uh, Claire Ford. Jesus Christ, this guy's cooler than I'll ever be in my life. <laughs> the Ghouls t-shirt, flashing comedy sign. Jesus, well, Sarah, by the way, nothing comes close to the sign that you made. Just want to make that <laughs> clear. Uh, thanks for joining us, Carol and Dave. Have you been in our front row before? Yeah, we have, we have Russell Howard behind us. Before. Oh, I remember. Yes, but, that's right. We had to find the police. But I, but I was so ashamed about it that I made this yesterday. You made it? Oh, my yeah. God. <laughs> I'm pleased. I've done well. You've do Dave, you've done very well. A little bit arrogant, but yes, you've done very well. <laughs> <laughs> you've done very well. Bless you, Carol and Dave. Lovely to see you. Alec Worsfold, give us a wave. My absolute hero. We love you, Alec. Uh, really knocked Richard Gill's nose out of joint. <laughs> Richard Gill thought he had the best laugh at always be comedy. Oh, poor Richard Gill. Richard Gill, like Ar Arnold Palmer at golf. I'm the best at golf. And then Alec Worsfold, Jack Nicholas comes along. The price is wrong, BH. Uh, so thank you, Alec. Bless your heart. Good to see you. Moira Stewart, give us a wave. Bless you, Moira. Great to see you. Uh, let me see the front row. Jill and Ken, our heroes up in Morpeth. How are you? Bless you. Um, how is every, everyone? I'm speaking to everyone at home, everyone on the front row. How are you all finding this lockdown at the moment as, as we get to the end of March? How are we finding it? Oh, yeah. Yeah. Really hard. Long, yeah. long. So people are doing thumbs yeah. down. People yeah. are at home, maybe sharing stuff, yeah. trying stuff out. Yeah. We got a lovely postcard from Ken. Now, Ken, give us a wave. Ken, my love. Ken, give us a wave. <laughs> <laughs> Turn it up, Ken. <laughs> we um. <laughs> We got a postcard from Ken. Kenny's Kenny's of a certain age, and this is extraordinary. I'm not. I don't want to say how old Ken is, but Ken censors this postcard. Incredibly. <laughs> 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 that from when he was a when he was a small boy growing up through the plague uh, yeah. <laughs> we just we just thought that was such uh, a lovely that time. looks exactly like Glasgow which is where I grew up by the way you're up, in, you're up in Glasgow <laughs> we learn more about our heroes each day I love it <laughs> and your pleasure uh, I'm glad he fucking laughed at that. I was shitting myself. <laughs> <laughs> now then, hang on. Megan Katie Lyle, first time on the front row. Give us a wave, Megan Katie Lyle. <laughs> right, this is lovely. This is genuinely lovely. Megan Katie Lyle. We didn't know. We didn't know this. That that Megan was was, was this. Megan is both the number one super fan. What are the chances of both Danny Buckler and Matt Ford? Whoa! <laughs> look, look at Megan. This is this is a this is emotional. It's a wonderful thing. So we booked we booked Danny and Matt, and then Ma Megan, Katie, Lyle got in touch, and it, what was apparent was she loves Danny and Matt. So you are delighted. This is a dream come true, Megan, Katie, Lyle. It really is, and just to be here with you all is so amazing. It's so <laughs> oh, round of applause, <laughs> Megan, Katie, Lyle. <laughs> Sorry, I, I've got to stop saying your full name. We're all about to add you on LinkedIn. <laughs> Everybody uses it. No, bless you. Thank you for thank you for joining us. It means a lot. And I'll be honest with you, I got a little bit jealous because I've never had uh, a super fan. And <coughs> the fact that Matt and Danny have got a super fan is a lovely thing. And I will share this with you, uh, Megan, Katie. Tim and I, when we do gigs together, Tim and I gig together a lot, or you know, central London and, and around London. Uh huh. And we have this thing where someone turns up to our gigs and we, we actually have to 
submit a poster to security and it's heartbreaking. <laughs> Tim, maybe you could share this. <laughs> 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 Please send me that. Yeah. <laughs> Richard, you're, I, mean, I, I was thinking about day. how hard you were laughing. <laughs> That's made my day. Uh, bless you, Richard. We were, we were, we're always very, as you well know, we're always very welcome to see you. The thing with Richard is he's about, he's about three foot taller than I am, so when he gives me a bear hug, He's like, great to see you, pal. And I'm like, <laughs> it's great to see you too, Richard. Um, oh, we, we look forward to seeing you soon, uh, Richard, my love, in the flesh. Adam and Definitely. Dr. Vic up in Manchester, give us a wet. God bless you. Great to see you. A semblance of sanity on the front row. And we're always, <laughs> always, <laughs> always grateful. We're always grateful. Uh, Doug McVeigh, live in America, give us a wave. This is the only man who made Keith Richards go, oh, hang on a minute, you've gone too far with the drugs. <laughs> <laughs> I'm going to check him out. Uh, if you've never met before, Doug McRae joins us from America every week and we're so grateful. It's so lovely to see him. <clears throat> And ever since I've ever since I've got to know Doug McVeigh, I for some reason I listen to a lot more Neil Young than I used to do. <laughs> <laughs> uh, Karen, give us a wave. Yay! How are you, Karen? Fine. One week to go to half term. Hang on, is this Karen Donald? <laughs> Yay! This Karen way? Donald. I feel like uh, Bruce Willis at the end of Die Hard, meeting the the copper who's become his best friend. Karen has been supporting this gig through thin and thin since <laughs> uh, original <laughs> lockdown last uh, last April when we launched, but she's never been on the front row before, so this is a big deal for for Tim. <laughs> <laughs> uh, bless you, Karen. Lovely to lovely to see it. That sounded creepy as it came out of my mouth. But, you know, <laughs> Lovely to see your face, Karen. But you, you know, <laughs> thank I've you. aged a lot in the last year, so I've been very frightened to come on the front row. Oh no, Karen! No, no, no. We, we, we Now that you're on the front row, we certainly w wouldn't uh, try and make this a, a reg as many regular running gags as possible. Brad Ashton, give us a wave. <laughs> oh, hey. How are we doing? Absolutely, mate. I'm all the better for seeing you. Oh, bless you, bless you. The only way of, 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 of being able to see myself and, and lovely Brad, look at Brad Ashton. This is a big deal, right? Brad Ashton has got... Right, one thing Tim and I have dreamed of is securing uh, a lucrative sponsorship deal for Always Be Comedy. And we've, we, you know, we've come close on a couple of deals. It hasn't quite materialised. <laughs> but thanks to Brad Ashton and his, his loyalty... Tim, can, can everyone see lovely Brad? Brad, give us a... <laughs> Who's <laughs> <laughs> the least I can do? Come on. No. <laughs> Honestly, for us to sign that deal, thanks to your loyalty to that brand and your <laughs> pleasure, Honestly, mate. Brad. Pleasure. No, mate. You know, we're all very great. Everyone at home watching, everyone on the front row is very grateful to your suspiciously dark hair. <laughs> <laughs> Uh, bless you, Brad. <laughs> Hang on a minute, Adam. Is in Adam, Doctor Vic. What are you? Ta are you thinking of dyeing your beard? Well, now I've seen the Grecian two thousand come out. It might be a good idea, mightn't it? <laughs> it? Seems seems like it's seems like it's a bit light. Yeah, <laughs> why not? Uh, Lovely Vic uh, to your uh, left there yeah, <clears throat> is is was looking at you there as if to say. You want to run this one by me first. <laughs> <laughs> I think you. I think yeah, no. I do, some of you have been coming for a while. I remember when I dyed my hair blonde last? Yeah. <laughs> yes. I mean, I, I mean, I would say, given how early I did that, that was that was. We were not enough weeks into lockdown for me to have a full breakdown. <laughs> <laughs> Was a quicker and worse breakdown than those celebrities that did that Imagine video. After a week, like, what you plan? Uh, right then, so tonight, uh, in, hang on a minute, Carol, give us a wave. Oh, yeah, Carol Benson. Carol, Jesus, Carol just remembered what her name was. <laughs> <laughs> 
Carol, mate, you right on Monday you looked a million dollars. Tonight you look a billion damn dollars. Congratulations. It's because Matthew's the, on. What's the secret? What do what do you rub into your face? <laughs> no. <laughs> <laughs> to be honest, as soon as I asked that question. I was relieved that you said lard. Yes. <laughs> uh, so tonight, all of friends, we have got uh, Janine Haruni. Yes. Yay. The magic man, Danny Butler. Yes. We have a not very special mystery guest. Yes. Yay. His words, his words. Uh, and then, oh, God, now I know a lot of you have bought a ticket for... Listen, this happens sometimes, it's comedy. You know, you, you book you book acts and you book them with a, with a pure heart. And when an act pulls out at short notice, that's, you know, that's comedy, unfortunately. So I'm afraid Matt Ford has had to pull out of the gig. <laughs> oh, oh, no. Oh. Yeah, I, no, I know people at home, look, I know, look I'm absolutely, I, I'm as cross as you are, honestly. But, <laughs> Don't ask me how we did it. I managed to get on the phone and pull in a few favours. Uh, we've managed to get the, the Prime Minister, Boris Johnson! <laughs> <laughs> what are the chances? <laughs> I imagine pretty much everyone knew where I was going with that, but I reckon there was at least one person at home going, What the fuck?! <laughs> <laughs> I paid money for Ford, damn you! Uh, right, front row, you are awesome as always. We're gonna we're gonna close at once ten. Uh, Richard Gill, okay, I like we're still down in that flagon of mead. Did you all see? <laughs> I wish. Bless his heart. Uh, Richard, after the show, if there's time, mate, we'll we will do a song. Would you like that, Rich? Yeah, no. I've got one ready. If you want one. Oh. We do. <laughs> 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 the, person shouted, the person who shouted no shouted so loudly they're not actually on the front row. <laughs> well, there's a crack in my window. I just heard that all the way from. The <laughs> uh, right then, we'll build the applause on set. Front row, as always, absolutely rocking. Karen, I can't believe you're on the front row. So lovely to see you. Brad, you look at. Brad, I'll be honest with you, mate. You dress like you're doing a 12 stretch. <laughs> <laughs> Cheeky bastard. <laughs> Tell you what, mate, if they reboot Porridge, you'd be a fucking great guy. <laughs> <laughs> Hang on, Brad, I'm just going to go around to get some snout. Off <laughs> 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 <Of> grouty. <laughs> 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 I just uh, laughed at my own niche porridge reference. <laughs> topical as ever. Yeah, I was going to say, you know I mean? these, were, these are the topical references. You <laughs> read Jack Nicholas and the. Uh, was it all the time earlier? Yeah. Think of two sports people who are rivals. My brain. You want to go for Arnold Palmer and Jack Nicholas? <laughs> 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 Oh my god! <laughs> <laughs> Ken was going, mate, too far back. <laughs> <laughs> Speaking of Arnold Palmer, my wife went to the shops earlier. No, it's not. It's not the sort of show to share that. Smutty, very smutty. Sorry, mommy, if you're watching, I, I, don't know. I don't know. I don't know what that innuendo meant. Uh, right, we'll the applause at one to ten. Uh, instead of ten out of ten, we will go. I'll tell you what, we'll go Adam and Doctor Vic out of ten. Uh, so let's start high. We'll go seven out of ten applause. Yay.